I haven't given a testimony in a long time. <laughs> well, y'all, y'all, well, I don't want to tell y'all what's happening with me because y'all are nosy. I'm going to keep it to myself. Amen. 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 Um, well, I will. You know, for, for years I had a problem. And um, I didn't know how it was going to be solved. But I remember when, when I was at um, Greater St. Mark's and, and a prophet came in. And, and, and the prophet said, God's going to fix it. It's, it, it may have been three years ago, and all these three years I was wondering, how is he going to fix it? 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 And um, last week he fixed it. Amen. And it, it was, it was a, tr- a tremendous problem, a problem of, of great embarrassment. Um, but that goes to show exactly what Mother was talking about. We have to wait on the Lord, and sometimes it, it's not going to look right. And it don't look right because... We're, we're flesh and everything bothers us. We, we, we're like children. We, we can't wait to have dessert. We want the candy now. And, and sometimes it looks like it's not going to happen. And the thing is that I had a deadline of like three days. Yeah. No, no, no. Sorry. Seven days. I had a seven, seven more days and the thing would have been blown. But God came through. So that, that's to remind you that whatever it is you're going through, you know, whatever God promised you, whatever he has said to you, Hold on to it. Don't worry yes. about it. I'm telling you, don't worry, don't worry, Ooh, don't worry. Yeah. And I worried myself sick. And, and the funny thing is that once he promised you something, and once he's told you something, you'll get reminders in your spirit. Yes. Yeah. It'll rise up in your spirit. You'll feel it. You, you, you'll, you'll get a yes. remembrance. And, and I remember I was waiting on a part of this thing, and I was walking around with a friend of mine, and, and uh, He's a good guy. Um, my, he's a good friend. He's Italian. He's a great guy. Gets on my nerve, but he's my he's, he's my good friend. And while we were while we were going about our business, a spirit, a feeling in my spirit came over and, and says, it, "It's going to happen, and you're going to get it." And five minutes later, I got a call. <laughs> you got it. So that just to tell you, but I had there was more pieces in place to get, to get the final yes. thing done. But that goes to show you, um, people, and I, I just don't want you to worry about nothing. And remember that Satan is a tool, and Satan is a tool to sift you. He's a sifter. Yes. He goes through the earth, Satan can do, he may devour, mm-hmm. you know. But his devouring, he's all, he's all bark and no bite. Because all he wants to do is test you to see if you're really going to stand or you're going to fall. And, and that's all he wants to do. Yes. So when, when, when trouble comes, understand, it's just the enemy sifting you. He's messing with you. I bother y'all all day long, don't I? Okay? I'm not Satan. But you know what I mean. Just bothering you, bothering you, bothering you. And, and if you don't let it get to you, you'll be fine. So, and even if it takes the last minute, even if it's your last breath, you'll hold on to God's promise. Watch it come through. And the thing is that he waits until there's no other reason for it. There's no other excuse. You, you can't say I got it because I hit the lottery. You can't say I, I got it because I'm cool today. You know, you're going to know that you have no other chances. He wants to imprint upon your mind that he is Lord, mm-hmm. even in your trouble. And that's why things take long, because he, he, he's a jealous God, first commandment. I'm a jealous God, and I shall have yes. no other yes. God before yes. me. Yes. And he's also the Alpha and the Omega. Omega. Yes. So he's there in the last part, too. Beginning. That's yes. right. So don't worry. Don't Just stand, people. Yes. If you got a promise from God, stand on, on his promise, and he will make it happen every time. I have never seen the righteous forsaken, know what? The seed begging for bread. Yes. Amen. Y'all just hold on, okay? Amen. Amen.